the sweepstakes winner. I've been looking forward to... No! No! Hey! Hey! I've been talking a long time! I sense movement! I need a new battery! Can you hear me? A new battery! Oh, oh, I sense we're near the lighthouse. Ask that old fool how the road to the south is. <laughs> What's that? Who's there? Who are you? What's the password? I can't let you in without the password. And don't try swordfish, I know it's not that. I tried it myself, I couldn't get in. So I know it's not that. Well, we haven't had any visitors here since, oh, I don't know how long. You must be another one of Rupert's sweepstakes winners, huh? Okay, what's the password? Did you say the password? I can't remember. I can't let you in without the password, so you must have already said it, huh? It's a good thing you knew the password. It's not safe out there. Those buzzards will steal everything that's not nailed down. Sticky fingers. <laughs> I'd say magnetic. The other day, one of them flew by and my shovel flew off after it. People used to come here and bring me everything I needed. But now, hardly anybody comes up here. The mayor and I have an anti-vulture warning system worked out. But without the lights, we don't know if it works or not. Down the road to the south, east and west Shanbar used to span the northern river. But East Shanbar just up and disappeared, and West Shanbar just went south. Well, actually, it didn't just disappear. It sort of, you know, gradually disappeared. First the inn, and the general store, and Mudok's place. It's eerie. Even half the bridge is gone. You look up there. Runs on aluminite. But you don't know what aluminite is. It glows brighter than swamp gas. Those darn buzzards moved in and started stealing. One of them stole my aluminite rock from the tower. Now this place is useless. Come back any time. Let me know if you find any extra aluminite. I could use it. That old boar. Oh, oh, that reminds me. Did you hear the one about the apple? <laughs> <laughs> About the appetite of the wild boar <laughs> in the forest of the spirit. Who are you? I 
Don't matter. Want some rye? Of course you do. Want some rye? Of course you do. Here's to us. Want some rye? Of course you do. Who's like us? Want some rye? Of course you do. Damn few. Want some rye? Of course you do. My my keys? Oh 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 sure yeah yeah. I, I, I'm too dry to drunk. <laughs> Oh, would you pick up a six-pack while you're out? I'd be much obliged. <laughs> oh. And they're all dead. And that's the only way to get out of their life. I hope you remember that when the time comes. What year is it? Oh yeah, the Great Diffusion was 1247. That was 400 years ago. My birthday's coming up soon. Well, you are late. It's all right, but don't let it happen again or be marked down on your permanent record. Tardiness. Good work habits. I like that. First, we're going to have a little pop quiz. Oh, no. Not a test. I'm so happy to have someone to ask this of. Would you be so kind as to take this book and record what happened to East Shanbar and what caused it? 
I can't go myself. I have to be here if any of my students come back. Stay back. What do you want? I escaped from the cliffs of depression. I don't know how long ago. If only I could go to a happy place. Some more fun. Wow. I told myself if anyone was ever nice to me, I'd give them this. My father gave that to me before I escaped. He said it was good luck. I want you to have it. The mayor's office. That old windbag could power a city street for a whole week with one speech. Well, a new constituent. I'm the mayor of Shambar. Glad to meet you. I hope you're registered to vote. That guy drinks so much, even his plants are potted. <laughs> Want some raw? Of course you do. <laughs> Want some raw? Of course you do. Go away! I haven't got anything for you! I've only got one milk cow, and she only eats carrots! So just go away! Ah, that's all right. Just take what you need and go away. And you can take that ludicrous box out there too. 
I didn't order it, and I didn't want it. The missus didn't order it, and she doesn't want it. And the cow don't need it either. So just go. Yikes! I remember a great explosion. You know, it was back in 1247, and we had to destroy everything magic, whether it was mechanical or enchanted. Had to go. We even blew up the Froboz Magic Company and all its inventory. Boy, was that a good one. We seem to be working at cross purposes. I must relieve you of your belongings until you learn.